Welcome to Binary Bytes, your source for bite-sized tech knowledge. In today's video, we will cover the topics, legal issues in e-commerce and different laws for e-commerce. Firstly, we are going to see legal issues in e-commerce. E-commerce involves a wide range of legal issues that businesses must be aware of to operate within the law and protect themselves and their customers. Some of the major legal issues of e-commerce include Copyright issues E-commerce businesses must ensure that they are not infringing on the copyrights of others when using images, music, or other copyrighted materials on their website. Violating copyright laws can result in costly legal battles and damages. Privacy issues E-commerce businesses must protect the personal information of their customers, such as name, address, credit card information, and other data collected during the sales process. Failure to comply with data privacy laws can result in fines, legal action, and damage to a business's reputation. Trademark issues E-commerce businesses must avoid infringing on the trademarks of others by choosing unique names, logos, and branding for their business. Infringing on trademarks can lead to legal action and financial damages. Database sharing issues E-commerce businesses must be careful when sharing customer data with third-party service providers or partners. They must ensure that they have the necessary permissions and comply with data privacy laws to avoid legal issues. Insurance issues E-commerce businesses should have appropriate insurance policies in place to protect against risks such as product liability, cyber attacks, and data breaches. Failing to have adequate insurance coverage can result in significant financial losses. Consumer issues E-commerce businesses must comply with consumer protection laws and regulations such as those related to advertising, product safety, pricing, and refunds. Violating these laws can result in legal action, fines, and damage to a business's reputation. As an e-commerce business, you must follow certain rules to protect your customers. These rules are about things like making sure your ads are honest, selling safe products, and being clear about your prices and refund policies. If you don't follow these rules, you could get into trouble with the law, have to pay fines, and hurt your business's reputation. Now moving to the topic laws for e-commerce. India has several laws and regulations that govern e-commerce activities in the country. Here are some of the key laws that businesses should be aware of. Information Technology Act 2000 This law provides the legal framework for e-commerce transactions in India. It covers a wide range of issues related to electronic records, digital signatures, and electronic authentication of documents. Consumer Protection Act 2019, this law was recently enacted to provide better protection to consumers in e-commerce transactions. It includes provisions related to unfair trade practices, product liability, and consumer grievances. Payment and Settlement Systems Act 2007, this law regulates payment systems in India and covers online payment gateways, electronic fund transfers, and other payment systems used in e-commerce transactions. Foreign Exchange Management Act 1999 This law regulates foreign exchange transactions in India and governs the repatriation of funds from e-commerce transactions involving foreign entities. Goods and Services Tax Act 2017 This law governs the collection and payment of taxes on e-commerce transactions in India. It requires e-commerce platforms to collect and remit GST on behalf of sellers. Competition Act 2002 This law regulates competition in the Indian market and covers issues related to anti-competitive practices, abuse of dominant position, and mergers and acquisitions. Copyright Act 1957 This law governs intellectual property rights in India, including copyright protection for digital content used in e-commerce transactions. Information Technology Intermediaries Guidelines Rules 2011, this set of guidelines outlines the responsibilities and liabilities of intermediaries, such as e-commerce platforms and online marketplaces, 
in relation to content uploaded by users on their platforms. It is important for e-commerce businesses to comply with these laws and regulations to avoid legal liabilities and ensure the protection of consumer rights. That's all for today's e-commerce lecture. We hope you found it informative and insightful. If you enjoyed the video, please show your support by liking and sharing it with your friends. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel for more bite-sized tech knowledge and hit the notification bell to stay up to date with our latest uploads. We will be back soon with more exciting lectures on e-commerce and other tech topics. Till then, keep learning and we will see you in the next one.